Well, I'm already thanks to Mars. I think I figured out what YouTube is up to. Now, I've already ta done this story about how they're labeling government sources. Uh, sources that receive government money, and I kind of lamented the fact that the Alphabet channels won't be included in that, as much as they're basically run by the Democratic Party. But anyway, uh... So, here we have all this stuff that labeling government sources. PBS is angry about this. I'm a little surprised at uh, that. But PBS is off in their own little world. So, we're going to scroll down, and I think we have our answer here. In this article from The Hill. The social media giants have been criticized by lawmakers for not revealing the extent Russian activity on their platform meant to influence the election. That tells you a great deal. Despite YouTube's efforts to combat negative views of state media, U.S. broadcaster PBS's last out move. See, I failed to consider when I did the first uh, video, I failed to consider the fact that the news outlets that aren't receiving public funding won't be labeled. So, they're not actually turning on the left. Like you said, as far as I'm concerned, ABC, NBC, CBS, so forth, should be uh, labeled. But they're not. But they're not turning on the left. This is the thing. The fact that these sites will be labeled and the others won't will give Americans who already pretty much trust government news, which I don't, some place to go. And conversely, those sites, new sites that aren't labeled as being as taking government money, now they're going to come under scrutiny. See, if they're taking government money, they're going to be called, you know, they're going to be the good guys, they're going to be considered ones on the right side of things, even though they're on the left. And the people who aren't receiving government money will bring news they're the ones that are going to be under suspicion. You see how this works? I mean, eventually the left will... Except for the big shots like, uh... Cannabis News Network, and NBC, CBS, so forth. So, that's the way this is going to work, I think. Um... We'll be able to say... Okay, this source receives government money, this source receives government money. These are the ones we want you to watch. The ones that aren't receiving government money and are independent, we don't want you to watch them. That's what's happening here. I believe. I knew there was a rat in the wood pile. I knew there was something wrong because... Figuratively speaking, I can feel the hair sticking right up on the back of my neck. I knew they were up to something, I just didn't know what. And that's what I'm thinking is going on here. If you're an independent news source, excluding the uh, Alphabet channels, which really aren't independent news sources, you're going to be under increasing amounts of scrutiny and censorship in the coming months. See, the ones that are labeled will have their badge of honor, and they'll be exempt. Ones that aren't labeled, you're screwed. You have to remember, is the people who work at YouTube and Google, many and most of them are from socialist countries where trust in government is everything. That's what we have going on here. Just you independents, you're screwed. I'm Artifacts of Mars. I wish I had better news for you, but I don't. 
I'm pretty certain I'm right about this. See that one uh, paragraph there? Unbelievable. Thanks for watching.